<sighs> right, so here we are. Um, I am showing you my collection. But first of all, uh, if you guys want to like and subscribe, then that would be brilliant. It reflects my channel greatly. And if you guys are enjoying my videos, make sure you do smash a like on my videos, comment some stuff, anything you want. Improvement on my videos, um, uh, ideas, etc. So yeah, let's get started. Let me quickly get these coins. I forgot about these. Um, right, so down here in my safe, Oh, you can't really see it, sorry, but I have tons and tons of albums that are all full. Uh, so you got each of the 50p, £2, £1, Olympics, every single folder they do. It's all completed with medallions, all the various coins. And I've got these spare coins here. These all came in the post today. Two Q Guns and a Tosha £2, 2011 Youth Games coin. So yeah, that was a nice surprise. So the reason I waited so long to do this is because, um, like this is basically everything best in my collection. I'll show you what else I've got. So here is, I've actually completed this now. So this is one reason I held back on doing the um, collection video. So let me, um, so here we've got all the Christmas coins. These are non-colored ones. So here, this is like a two grand, three grand set here. Um, you've got the two snowman coin, they're like 300 quid each, and then you've got all the rest. So let me know what you guys think about these. Then, um, in this box, oh, I've got all the coloured ones. So, yet again, you have the two snowmen. Wait, where are they? They're in there, so they're about... This one, this is 2003, it went for 600 and twenty pound, I believe the two thousand eight went for six hundred and forty pound on eBay the other day. So yeah, these are all like doubled in price since I've had them. It's like two hundred quid. This is like three hundred and something. Yeah, so they're expensive set. Honestly, never ever sell them. Best thing I have to date in my collection. <sighs> right. So yeah, I didn't want to get all these albums out down there because there's just so many and they're all complete. Here I just have a bunch of cities, you know, they're not worth anything now. Um, you got a blue Peter, this is the rare one, 2009, should be dated 2011, just like 100 odd quid um, in here. So I've had this for over a year now, so I went, this is like my never to sell box. Oh, I put that in the wrong way. Um, so here you've got two 2015 trials, you've got... Two Q Gardens, one Bunk Q Gardens, one Proof, uh, EEC, sorry. So this is like 500 odd quid in here. You know, I said I'll never sell that box. I still haven't yet. So here we've got the box here. Most of you can guess. I cleaned this set. Uh, why is it not coming out? Yeah, I've cleaned this set because I just hate Tony. It's not something I can handle with. Um, so here we've got number 34. We've got the Pied Foot set. So pied foot, if you guys don't know, it means it's double the thickness, so it's heavier. Um, this set, it's like 350 quid. A fair bit. Uh, here we've got like some silver proofs, like this, so. Um, EC, this is pied foot one, like 90 odd quid, 80 quid. Here, this I think is the penguin coin. Wait, this is how you open it. There we go. This is the Aero Penguin. That's like 70 odd quid. Um, this is the guy of the set I'll show you in a minute. Because I've got filing cabinets and most of it's in the filing cabinets. Um, here, obviously, you know, we've got the Gold Key Gardens. This cost me £1,760. <coughs> yeah, I bought this off of eBay. Got a, I was on the phone to the guy. He's really nice. Um, just told me that's what he invests in gold coins. Uh, you got the pie for one pound here. Let me swipe that back in there. Nah. Um, I bought this because so PayPal done a thing, right? They done get twenty percent off signing off your coins, like not not off coins, like off your purchase. And I bought this. This costs like this is a full sovereign, by the way. Um, what number is it? I actually don't even know what number. One thousand one hundred fifty-three. This costs like 300, 400 year old quid. I got it for like 
310 pound because of the paypal thing where they've done like 20 odd percent off so i thought you know what let's get something i need and it has sentimental value so I literally just bought that this is this might be a long video sorry guys but this was highly requested you've got silver ec this is about 50 60 odd quid uh so this is still sealed it's the one of the 2017 annual coin sets uh most of you guys know what these are you can just search up it's got like all the coins that came out in 2017 and they're bunk so brilliantly uncirculated same again for the 2018 i thought i'm going to start collecting these now because they're pretty cool right here we have uh the 1992 proof set so obviously i only got it for the eec because it's a rare coin so why not <clears throat> and then Still in good condition, I'm happy with it, keeping it. Don't think I'll sell it for a while. And I can't shut it. I don't know why. The box is getting a bit dodgy. Anyway, uh, let's move oh, this stuff over here. So I've got these. Um, you got the Strike Your Owns. Finally got these. No one helped me out though, I had to buy them. It cost me like 35 quid a pop. Uh, you got the last round pound and the new pound. So they're pretty cool. Um, I bought this because... Wait, sorry, I need to get up. I bought this because some I haven't really seen any of these before. And I saw an auction on the Facebook group. So I was like, you know what? I need this. Like, it's gorgeous. Like, it's a special issue one. Um, my mate's got two of them. They're pretty nice. He's got, like, number 30. Right, so this is a stunner. You know, it is gorgeous. And pretty much, um, I won't be buying many more coins because I'm buying a car. So, yeah, no more really nice coins for a little while. So here, I might have to sell some, which I don't really want to do. But here we have the Pied Foot Commonwealth set. Gorgeous set. I don't think I would ever sell this because, don't get me wrong, these sets are like the most, if this is a word, tonable set out there. Like, every single set has toning on it. Like, this one, I haven't even cleaned this one. I don't know if they cleaned it before. But it's got no, like, literally minimal to none toning at all. So I just thought, you know what, yeah, this is getting a little bit, actually. But I just thought, you know what, I need this. Especially when it has no toning as well, I'm buying it. I think I've had it for a few months now cost me like 300 i think i think i paid high for this i think i paid 360 for this so of course sealed q gardens that's the bunk one sealed bunk set the 2009 sealed baby set and then the pnc so you know you've got like 800 odd quid worth there because they all go for just over 200 quid each so here we've got let's go find out <clears throat> I had this for a long, long time now. It's a proof set of the 2009. I only got it because of the queue, you know. Um, I had it for like maybe a year now. All right. The big, big, big set. You know, most of you have seen this, but I thought I'll share it anyway in case you're new here. Make sure you do smash that like, though. Um, right. I The amount I saw on eBay, you know... I missed one that came to like 500 odd quid. These are like nearly a grand set. I was looking at these like 600 quid. I was like, nah, I'm going to try to get one cheaper. Then it went down. Uh, then they had none left. And the only ones about were like 850 quid to a grand. I was like, nah, I can't pay that for it. So it's a silver proof 2009 45th anniversary set. I did swap about 900 pound worth of coins. So... You remember, if you remember, I had the Pied Foot one pound City set, Pied Foot Floral set, and then I swapped. Oh, I can't remember. I swapped something else as well, but I swapped all that for uh, this set because, don't get me wrong, it's a lovely set, and maybe next year in 2019, they're going to release a 50th anniversary because this is the 40th. We might do a 50th if they do. I will just buy it because it's going to have the Q Gardens in it. You know it's going to go up in value. Maybe they'll value it high because they know the price of the Q Gardens. But 
honestly what a set this is is absolutely gorgeous but yeah so let's get into some other stuff this is like the cheaper stuff i have in my collection now so if we go over to here i literally just have loads of bunk coins spare coins like ducks and everything um yeah like not very interesting stuff uh i've got an olympic coin there um don't know what's in there oh shite right so they were the penguin coins the circular penguin coins i'll sort of that in a minute and then if i go over to here i've got some other stuff so i need to pull like this pepsi out of the way um so i don't know get them in this drawer i just have like i don't know just small little things this and then i have like bitch which what it says i've got loads of receipts in there um and yeah i just have oh there's the penguin set right there as you can see so as you can tell yeah my collection is worth a fair amount what have i got in here and i've just got loads of spare olympics in here this is my little olympic uh tray so yeah this is like my collection i hope you guys actually do like these um i'm thinking of getting some making some more albums but i'm not sure yet it will be soon but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'll see you guys on the next one leave a like subscribe comment what you want to see in my next video and yeah peace out